guys. Today, we're gonna make a, a ball maze. Now to do this, we're gonna do it a, a couple of different ways. The first way we're gonna do is on a little tray. So I'm gonna use my tray to make one. You could use a box lid or a paper plate. So we're gonna do both ways. I went outside and um, gathered some sticks. So I went out with my dog and I collected some straight sticks, um, all different sizes in case you didn't have straws, because um, you can use straws for this or some sticks. So I have some straws, some straight sticks, some uh, scraps of paper you're gonna need, and I have a piece of tin foil, and I have a couple little pom-poms, but you can also use a marble or a small little bouncy ball, okay? So, or any little ball that would bounce, <sighs> sticks, okay. You're also gonna need a glue stick, or some um, Elmer's glue all, or a hot glue gun. If mom's gonna let you use a hot glue gun, that would be great. I have a hot glue gun just because I'm gonna make it go real fast today. But you can, if you wanna delay your gratification and let it dry time, use that. You can also use tape, okay, if you let it go and tape it. Uh, so we'll be doing um, some tape for the paper, but I'm gonna use the glue, glue gun to get it done real fast. You can also use packaging tape. So, and you're gonna need a pair of scissors. Uh, so let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do is you wanna map out a maze for your ball. So I'm gonna start with a start line. So I'm gonna start my maze right here and I'm gonna write, write the word start, S-T-A-R-T. So I wrote start right here at the bottom. And I wanna say, where does the path of my ball wanna go? So I'm gonna make my ball go in a direction. So I'm gonna say, He's gonna go all the way up here, and then I wanna shoot him down here, and maybe I wanna go here, and I'm gonna go over to here, and I'll go down, and I'll go all the way over, and up here, and I'll come over to here, and down here, and I'm gonna end right here. This'll be my end, right here. And I'll make a happy face where he's gonna end. Okay, so that's my end. And I'll put a little X in his eye so that'll show where he's ending. Okay, he's not dead, he's just ending there. Okay, so here's my start, that's it. And I'll make little arrows to show the direction of the ball to go. Okay, so you'll know which way he's supposed to, to travel. All right. Now, the next thing you have to do is put some straw lines down or some sticks along the path. Did I do this right? Yeah. Oh, I changed direction, sorry, it's my bad, okay. So here he goes. So here he goes. So now I'm gonna take my glue stick, tap this so you don't want your marker to dry out. And I'm just gonna tape this so it doesn't slide down. Since I'm gonna be holding it up, okay? So, get my hair out of the way. All right, so. I have my straws, which are skinnier. So let's say I have a ball, but the pom-pom's bigger, and he could jump the, the straw really easy. To make it simpler, you might wanna pick a stick, which has a bigger diameter of the straw, so it'd be harder for my pom-pom to jump this. So I might say, I'll use my stick today. So I'll make it with my sticks. So what I wanna do is I wanna take my stick, and I'm gonna say, okay, I'm gonna line a stick up right here. So I might break a piece of my stick and I might put a lot of line of glue, my stick right here. I'll use my glue gun real quick and easy. I'll put a little drop of glue right here, just like that. And I'll put my stick along it. Hold it for a second, there it is. Okay, now on this side, what I wanna do is grab another piece of stick. I don't want him to jump off the edge. So I'll put a little glue right here. So my pom-pom's gonna stop at the top. And I'll put a little glue right here. So my pom-pom's gonna stop right up there. There he goes. Now he's gonna bounce off that. I don't want him to go over here. So I'm gonna grab another stick right here. And I want him to shoot back down again, right? So I'm gonna break this a little bit. Whoops, breaky. Oh, a stick, okay. Miss TC's getting weak in her old age. Okay, here we go. Put a little glue down. Here we go, got that. that on there 
Got it. Got it, got it. I'm gonna drop a glue on the side. Here we go. Glue, glue, glue. Okay, so I got pom-pom going up, pom-pom coming down, but I don't want them to fall over here, so I'm gonna put a pom-pom over here. I mean, a glue, glue over here, too. So I'm gonna put a little drop of glue right here to keep them in. Okay, so see where that's gonna go? Line it up. This goes pretty fast once you got a plan. Gotta have a plan, always plan to action. You need a plan to action. Always need a plan, gotta have a plan. Now, I want them not to fall off the bottom, so I'm gonna put a little stick down there. You do that real fast. Hope you guys can see this. I'll try to hold it up a little. There you go, see that? See how I'm doing? Okay. I'm gonna shoot him back up now. Shoot him back up the, up the line. Put him right back here like this. There you go, like that. Like that plan. Shoot him back in. Here you go, up you go. Upsy daisy. Up with ya. There he goes. So it's going bing, 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 over. Okay. And I'll just throw in a straw right here because, oh, no, I won't. I'll go with a stick. Go with a stick. So I'm going to throw a stick right. I'll break him. I shall break you. Jeez, my sticks are strong. <laughs> or else I'm really weak. <laughs> He's, he's getting weak. <laughs> okay, I'm going right there, right here. Straw right here, right here. Okay, so here he is. I'm gonna put it right there. That's what I'm doing. Got a plan, got a plan. Okay. I'm gonna make this a little smaller. We'll go with this guy. Here. All right, got that, got that. Now I'm going back down, going back down, going back down. I can ever break a straw, break a stick, right? My my, my bionic sticks. <laughs> Yay for me! I broke one. <laughs> got it! Got it! Got it! Got it! All right. Oh, here I go. I'm going this guy. Ah, no, I'm not. <laughs> Yay! Oh, victory! <laughs> Victory, the hand. Okay, here he is, got him, got him. All right, got that, got that. Here he goes, go right there, right there, right there, yes. Got it, I got it, I got it. I got this, I got this. Got this. I need to start eating some Wheaties, I think. Let me see, gotta get some Wheaties on her. Here we go, there we go, see, see? I see, I see, I see, said the blind man. There you go. Oh, liking it, liking it. Need one along the bottom so I don't fall down there. Holy moly, okay. I did it, I did it, I did it. I was victorious. Okay, here we go. Here we go, got it, got it, got it. Got it, here we go, okay, see, 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 got it, got it. All right, and I'm going back up. Gotta go up, gotta go up. And we'll just use this whole stick. We're gonna put him hole down hole. We're just doing the whole thing. Here we go. Get him right in there. Yep. There you go, there you go. Okay, so my line's going up. Gotta go over, gotta go over. Going over, going over. There you go, I like it, I like it. Oop. Okay, there, yep. Him down. There he is. There he is. There we go. And I gotta go down, right? Oh, let's do it. Let's do it. Going down. Maybe I don't even have to. I can follow this stick. I'll just do a little one. Just put a little baby one right there. Follow him. Okay. He'll bounce off here. Go down again. I'll hit him again. Oh. Maybe I can make this all happen by itself. You might just follow it right in. Should we try it? So anyway, we'll, we'll see what happens. Let's put a ball in and see what happens. So let's see. So what we're gonna do, let's make a let's make a pom-pom ball. So let's say you don't have a pom-pom. Tin foil, tin foil works its magic. 
get the glue gun off my table so it doesn't drip on my table. All right, so we made a pom-pom ball, a tinfoil ball. Okay, this might be a little big. I'm gonna just chop a little off. Okay, now you wanna roll a ball, so. Just squinch him on up, real tight. Form a ball. Yep. All right. Roll him like a meatball. All right. Not bad. Not bad. I did that victoriously. Okay. Squish him down. Get him round. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna get up so we can see this. Put him in the start, and let's see if we can roll it around. Okay, we're gonna go over, down, well, jump the, jump the fence, we jumped the fence. Okay, we're back up, come up. My enthusiasm, right? We came up, let's go back down. Get back up there, yo, get up. Oh, ah. Get over the fence. Go down, come on, go to mama. Okay, there you go, come on up, come on up, come on. Come on, dude. Okay, over, Ooh. go down, go over, go to happy face. Go to the happy face with the X eyes. Go, 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 go. Ooh. Ooh. Yay! Cool. Okay, cool. Now, so you can see what we're doing. I would basically put a little box right here, which we could easily remedy right now. Box it in so he's not gonna fall out. There you go. And that would keep him right in there for you. So you guys can see how easily you can make these. But let's say you wanna make one on a plate, you would do the same exact way, but you can make this really complicated. So let me show you a different one I made earlier to show you how you can make it really complicated. So this was a super easy one. Let me show you one I made earlier. So this one I made in a box lid. And in this one, I put little loops on it. So here's my ball, here's the start over here right here and you would just go through and in this one I did straws and loops and I made my grid first and he goes through the loops and the straws this one's a little more complicated but you can build these and in this one I made it interchangeable so you could take this out and you can make different ones and put it into the box and that way you can switch up your game so your whole family can make one and then trap pass it around and and you guys could have different fun challenging each other on how to make them. You could put points, like if you go through how many hoops you go through, challenge yourselves to see how many points you can get, like five, 10, 15, 20, count by fives. If you only make it to here, you would make five, 10, 15, 20, 25 points. If you get to here, you would make more and just see how many each day, how you improve, count by tens, count by ones. You could make it a math game. You can do all different kinds of things. Spell words, you could do all different kinds of things on this. But it's a really fun way. You could count by money, you know, put coins down, anything you want, lay pennies down, make it a game on earning your allowance, anything you want. Not that I'm trying to cheat you out of your allowance, mind you, but I'm just trying to make it a little more challenging uh, for you. But it's really fun. If this is too low, you could put double up on your um, straws by just putting two straws on top of each other, gluing two down or taping two down on top of each other. Or like I said, using the thicker sticks would make it so the ball wouldn't hop on top of it. Or um, make it more challenging by using a tinier ball or a faster marble. A pom-pom goes a little faster. The smaller the ball, the faster the object, the heavier the ball, the faster. So have fun with it. Enjoy making these. Try to challenge yourselves. Have a great day. I hope you guys have fun making them. Take care. Bye, guys.